Let's first see what we are going to design today. Welcome to LoveCAD. Here is the easy to follow tutorials to design belt and pulley assembly with animation. So, let's do this. First, I am going to deal with the driver pulley according to the dimension shown in this drawing. First, select the front plane. Go to sketch. Select circle. Draw two concentric circles. Select dimension. The bigger circle is up to 120 mm. The smaller is of 25 mm. Go to features. Extrude boss. Select mid plane. And dimension give 25 mm. Now select this surface, go to sketch, normal, select one circle, give the dimension, as 85 mm, go to features, extrude cut, of 10 mm, click ok, now I am going to mirror this feature. For this, select front plane, select mirror, select the feature, click OK. Again select the surface, go to sketch, normal, convert entities and make a circle of 25 mm and the second circle of 27 mm. Go to features, extrude boss, select 2 mm and in direction to give the dimension as 7 mm. Okay. Now again select this surface, normal. Select circle, make a PCD of 50 mm, check for construction, now again select the circle, make a circle of 12 mm, dial, add one of the quadrant. now select circular pattern select the circle and give here 5 number of circle ok go to feature extrude cut select through all ok now select the top plane go to sketch normal now make the groove as shown in the drawing. For this first make a center line. Now make the sketch. Close the sketch. Go to smart dimension. Give the dimension 3 mm. Again, give the dimension 3 mm from this edge. Give the height as 6 mm. Angle between these two lines is 60 degree. Again, the angle is 60 degree between these two lines. Now go to features, revolve cut, select ok. So here is the basic design of pulley one.
now edit the appearance select metal steel apply it okay now save this pulley for this go to save as name it pulley 1 Now here is the drawing of pulley 2. See the dimension. And draw according to this. Go to front plane, sketch, select circle, make two concentric circle. Give the dimension. The first one is of 80 mm, and the smaller one is of 20 mm. Go to features. Extrude boss, select mid plane, give the dimension 25 mm. Okay. Now select the surface, go to sketch, normal, select circle, create a circle. Now select smart dimension, give the dimension of 17.50 between these two circles. Okay, go to features, extrude cut, give the dimension 10 mm, okay, now select front plane, select mirror, select the feature, okay, so this is the shape, now select this surface again. Go to normal, select convert entities and copy the circle. Now again select the circle, create one circle of 22 mm dia. Ok, go to features, extrude boss. Give the dimension as 2 mm and in direction 2 give the dimension as 7 mm. Okay. Now again select the surface, go to sketch, normal, create a PCD of 34 mm. Check for construction, give the dimension 34 mm, again select the circle, create a circle of 6 mm dia at quadrant of this circle, go to circular pattern, select number of circle as 5. Ok, go to features, extrude cut, select through all, ok. Now select top plane, go to sketch, normal, create a center line, now again select the line and sketch, draw sketch as shown in the figure for grooves, close the sketch, select smart dimension, give the dimension as 3mm from this side, again give 3mm dimension from this edge. The angle between these two lines is 60 degree and between these two lines is again 60 degree. The height is 6 mm.
Now go to features, revolve cut, select OK. Give the appearance. Select steel, apply it, click OK. Now save this as pulley 2. Go to save as. Name it pulley 2. So the next part is assembly for this. Select new assembly. OK. Now I am going to first create two axes for this. Go to reference geometry. Select axis. Select the right plane and top plane for axis 1. Select OK. Now select so axis. Now create a plane at the distance of 200 mm from right plane. OK. Now select axis. Select plane 1 and plane 2 for axis. Now go to insert component, select the pulley one, open, place the pulley, note in SOLIDWORKS assembly mode the first part to insert is automatically fixed in space. This means it cannot rotate or translate. As you can see, so we add float to the object so that it can be easily moved. Now select mate, select the inner part and the axis one. Check OK. Now again select the surface and the front plane. Select OK. So see how this is rotating, press OK. Now insert the second pulley. Go to mate, select the inner part and axis 2 and click OK. Now select this surface and this surface of pulley 1 and click OK. Now hide the axis. Now I am going to add belt between these two pulleys. For this, go to assembly features, select belt and chain, select the base of the groove of pulley 1 and pulley 2. Check here, click OK. Now save as belt save now see the relation between these two pulleys as they are connected with belt now next go to belt click on it open now create a plane with reference to right plane at this point select the plane go to sketch normal select line draw a say draw the shape of belt close this select smart dimension Give the height as 6 mm. Dimension of this line is 
the angle between these two line is 60 degree and between these two line is again 60 degree now select point mark at the center of this line select ok now press shift select this point and this point and give the relation as concentric click ok exit hide plane 1 Go to sweep boss, select this and select the path, press ok. Now edit the appearance. I am selecting fabric, cloth and apply it, ok. Now go back to your assembly. Select no. Now hide the sketch of belt. Okay, this is working fine. Now I'm going to add motion. For this, select motion study. Go to settings, make the frame rate 30, select motor, select the surface, you can change the direction of this motor, first assign the RPM as 50 RPM, see how you can change the direction, ok. Now click on calculate, so our motion is ready, click play, now I am going to increase the duration to 12 seconds. Again press calculate. Ok done. Now click on play. So this is how our belt and pulley assembly looks like. Hope you all will like this video. If you have any query go ahead to the comment section and also share and subscribe us for more projects.